I get questions from women all the time about men who want far less than what they want and they want to know what they should do about it. So look, I don't know you, I've never met you, but if you're listening to this, my guess is that it's a message that you need to hear. You are worth more than that. He wants to hook up, hang out, and get the benefits of being in a relationship with you without calling it a relationship. He wants to see other people because monogamy isn't realistic, but you're expected to only be with him. He wants all the benefits of being in a relationship, but when you talk to him about being in one, he's confused and unsure or not ready. You are worth more than that. He wants to disappear for weeks at a time with no message and pop back up in your life like nothing ever happened, expecting, expecting you to let him back in. He wants to pretend like you're in a relationship together, but when you're out in public or around his friends and family, you're just a friend, his dirty little secret. You are worth more than that. If you're used to being treated badly, taken for granted, pushed aside for something or someone else, you may start to believe that you don't deserve what you want. You get what you tolerate. Remember that. If you want something more, stop tolerating less. If you don't, you'll end up settling, looking back on your life, and wondering why you were cursed. You have to believe that you're worth more. Believe that you're valuable. Believe that you deserve more. Because in reality, you won't be cursed. You'll just be cursing yourself. So he wants a relationship with you. He wants a relationship with someone, but not with you. With you, he just wants to be friends with benefits. You give everything to him in the relationship, but he takes you for granted, doesn't make you a priority, and treats you like an option. He wants no responsibility for how he acts or his part in the relationship. You deserve more than that. He avoids discussing topics that are important to you. He wants to get all of his needs met, but he doesn't care if yours are met or not. He always tries to push past your boundaries instead of respecting them. You are worth more than that. Now you may be asking yourself, but Matt, what if I stop tolerating it and he leaves me? The real question that you should be asking yourself is what if you keep tolerating it and he stays? He keeps treating you the same way. Do you want to spend 10 plus years of your life as an option, as someone's fling? We have women in our community that have experienced this. Or would you rather free yourself so that you can be a man's priority, his one and only, the love of his life? He disappears and hides when you need him instead of being there for you. You're totally in love with him, but he only feels mildly interested in you. He's abusive to you mentally, physically, or emotionally. You are worth more than that. He's waiting for you to pursue him, contact him, invest in him while he doesn't do any of those things in return. He ignores your calls, texts, or messages for days or weeks at a time. A guy sends you one, a one-word message. You are worth more than that. He texts you forever, never setting up a date, never calling, never moving things forward. He wants to casually date you for 10 plus years without moving things to something more. He hides from you. He hides things from you, keeps everything a secret, and avoids opening up. You treat him like a king, but he treats you like a peasant. You are worth more than that. Listen, you deserve a man who thinks that you are too important to lose. Someone who loves you and cherishes you. Someone who worships you. The kind of man, this is the kind of man you should hold out for. So the next time a guy acts mediocre around you, just remember you are worth more than that. The only reason men do this is because you let them get away with it. It's time that we set a new standard.
If someone else wants to put up with this, fine, but you're worth more than that. Your beliefs determine what you experience in your life. If you believe that you deserve to be treated poorly, you'll accept people and circumstances that are beneath you. If you believe that you deserve something more, you'll pass up on those people and circumstances because you know that those are not for you. You can't believe in scarcity and have abundance. You can't believe that you deserve to be poor and keep wealth. You can't believe that you deserve to be treated poorly and keep a man who treats you well. You need to believe that you are a goddess, a queen, a miracle. You need to raise your standards if you want something more. You need to say, I deserve the best. I am blessed. I am beautiful. I am powerful. My suggestion is that today, right now, you shift your mindset. You believe that you are worth more than that and only allow in what's worthy of you and watch how things change and turn around in your life.